The world is based on a series of experiments. Basically, everything we know and do is because of experiments. From raising a chimpanzee with a baby to literally holding fire in your hand, here are 10 of the craziest experiments ever filmed. Number 10. Elephant Toothpaste David Dobrik has always been known for doing the craziest stuff and this experiment is not an exception. For this video, he teamed up with scientist Nick Uhas to break the record for the biggest toothpaste science experiment. Using 625 liters of hydrogen peroxide, around 30 bottles of soap, a lot of potassium iodide, and some blue food coloring, he was able to make his entire backyard blue. The moment they threw soap in the mixture, there was foam everywhere and it kept expanding. This wasn't the first time they did this experiment, though. Back in September of 2019, their attempt reached 67 cubic meters, but this time, it was much bigger. The experiment was more than three times as big. Once they'd cleaned everything up, the walls of David's house were stained blue, which probably took months of cleaning to get rid of. Number 9. Reborn some of the most insane and unethical science experiments of all time are done by Soviet scientists. But this takes the cake for crazy. Back in the 1940s, right before World War II, scientists wanted to learn how to bring someone back from the dead. So they decided to experiment on dogs first. These scientists removed this dog's head and attempted to bring it to life. So using a device known as the autojector, they pumped oxygenated blood through the arteries. The head reacted to sensations like it would if it was actually alive, twitching its eyes and ears in response to pokes and nudges. It even licked its own mouth. But the dog only ended up living for a couple of minutes after it was attached to the autojector. Number 8. The Baby Whisperer Every newborn's parents knows how tiring it is to take care of a baby that just won't stop crying. But this doctor has seemed to have it all figured out. After experimenting with lots of techniques, he found out exactly how to hold a baby to make it stop crying almost instantly. This is because it basically mimics the way they felt in the womb. He found that when you cross the baby's arm around its chest, it almost creates a sense of containment for them. He also held them at a 45 degree angle, which interested the baby. Baby. Usually, babies are held up, so they can only really see the ceiling. But when they're held at a 45 degree angle, they can see the floor and almost everything around them. Number 7. Relit While most crazy experiments are usually done by professional scientists, some can actually be done by regular people at home as long as you are careful about it. This experiment is one of them. At first, you really don't know where the experiment is going and the guy in the video just lets up a candle. Right after he lit the candle, he immediately put it out. When the candle was put out, he quickly fired up the smoke instead of the actual candle itself. The flame traveled all the way down the smoke and relit the candle. The heat from the flame burns up the wax whenever you light candles. When you blow out the fire from the candle, evaporated wax stays in the air for a short while. You can fire the wax and use the reaction to relight the candle's flame if you apply heat soon enough. Even though it might seem like you're lighting the candle with smoke, the wax vapor is actually what ignites it. Number 6. Chimpanzee vs. Baby We've all heard of those stories where human children are taken in by wild animals. Those kids then start acting like animals they're taken in by. Psychologist Winthrop Niles Kellogg and his wife were intrigued by this whole concept and decided to reverse the roles. So on June 26, 1931, they brought home a baby chimpanzee to raise alongside their baby. They wanted to see how the animal would react to its surroundings and if it would think it was a human. They kept the chimpanzee around for nine months and it actually showed a couple of signs of learning human behavior, but nothing out of this world. Their actual baby, on the other hand, started imitating chimp noises instead. In the end, the experiment was abruptly called off with no explanation, but everyone assumes it was because the chimpanzee was growing and getting stronger. Plus, with the lack of success they had in the experiment, there was no point in keeping the chimpanzee around anymore. So they sent it back to the chimpanzee enclosure they brought it from in the first place. Number 5. The Fire Trick Mixing hand sanitizers with fire seems like a pretty bad idea, and it can be. 
but if you're careful, you can even touch the flame. When you pour hand sanitizer and light it on fire, you can touch it and even hold it. Some people are brave enough to play around with the flame, but that doesn't seem like it's a good idea at all. It does feel a little hot at first, but nothing too crazy. But you should keep in mind that you're not supposed to hold the flame for longer than a couple of seconds, or else it can seriously burn your hands. That's why it's important to have some water right next to you when you do this, so you can immediately dunk your hands into the water right afterward. Number 4. The Bending Fork it usually takes a lot of manpower to bend a fork, but this guy managed to do it by just mixing a few things from around the house. First, he got some water and poured it into a glass. He then put some salt into the glass of water and mixed that in using a banana. After that, he put some baby powder on the banana, then mixed it in the glass once again. Next, he sprayed some oil into the concoction and mixed it with the banana again. Finally, at the very end of the experiment, you take a battery and throw that into the water. All this probably seemed meaningless up until now, right? Well, you'll finally get how crazy this experiment really is once you dip your fork into it. When he dipped his fork into the weird potion-like thing he made, the fork started bending from all sides, almost like it was in lava. Number 3. Dry Ice Everyone with even basic science knowledge knows ice explodes when it comes into contact with sodium. This is because of the layer of water covering the ice. No matter how cold ice can be, it'll usually have some water on top. This guy even tried it out in the video and there was a huge explosion because of the reaction. This guy wanted to do an experiment where the ice wouldn't explode when the sodium touched it, but that's basically impossible since ice always has a layer of water, right? Well, not always. He decided to bring some liquid nitrogen over to challenge this. He covered the ice in the liquid nitrogen in order to freeze that layer of water. So when he put sodium in the liquid nitrogen covered ice, there was no explosion at all. But when he put the sodium in water, Water, there was a huge explosion. Number 2. Out of this world People do all kinds of experiments, but not a lot of them involve garlic bread in space. Tom Scott partnered up with Steve Randall from Random Engineering and the host of My Virgin Kitchen, Barry Lewis, in order to send garlic bread to the edge of space and then eat it. They tied the garlic bread onto a styrofoam box and then attached that to a weather balloon. The balloon kept going up and up with the garlic bread until it reached space. When it made it about 22 miles up, the balloon finally popped and the box was sent down to Earth through a parachute. When the box finally made it down to Earth, they managed to track it down. When they found the garlic bread inside the box, they decided to eat it and find out if it was any different from regular garlic bread. Well, because of how cold it gets that high up, the garlic bread was basically frozen and probably didn't taste too appetizing either. Number 1. Molten Salt Usually when you mix salt and water together, nothing special really happens and it just becomes, well, salt water. But sometimes it can be a massive explosion. This guy melted some kosher salt and poured it into the water. The first few attempts didn't really get that far, but the third try created such a massive explosion, it literally broke the tank the water was in. The explosion occurred almost instantly and some tiny explosions even happened afterward. Alright, which one of these science experiments did you find the craziest? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to TrendJoint, and we'll see you in the next one.